It's a rather warm day here in Atlanta, Georgia. That's right, BB, it's another daily vlog. A vlog that happens pretty much daily. Coming to you live from Atlanta, Georgia. Live from Atlanta, Georgia. 100 degree weather, hot Atlanta. It's so hot, so hot. I need, I need something to quench my thirst. Definitely. Getting unloaded up here, I, Arrived at my destination early this morning as you can see the camera shaking because my trailers being moved I arrived early at my destination was told that I was gonna be a work in That got canceled. They had me come right here to downtown Atlanta as a matter of fact I passed where the Olympics were I seen the Olympic sign I seen the underground which is the old Atlanta underground I seen the aquarium seen all this stuff. I can't stop trucks are not allowed down here they make us take the loop around. So it's probably been since the mid to late 1980s that I've actually been in downtown Atlanta. And I'm not gonna be here very long. They have two pallets to take off. Then it's off to Orlando for a 10 o'clock tonight delivery. Hoping I can do it, I don't know. Depending on how long they take here, Atlanta traffic, Orlando traffic, I don't know if I can make it by 10 p.m. But we're gonna try for definite. Empty and back on the road. it down here to south central Georgia and I guess the schedule's been changed a little bit so you know what that means that means it's time to get some lunch at one of my regular stops that you guys have probably seen before but uh, on the way down here I was watching some YouTube videos well kind of listening you know I listen I, I, I like to listen to podcasts and I like to listen to vlogs vlogs on YouTube and uh, I've noticed there's a, quite a few truck drivers that vlog. I never even knew that before. So I was doing a couple quick searches and there's the regular ones that uh, some of us follow. And then there's other ones that are just starting up. But I've noticed something, it's kind of a trend. And it's not just in the truck driver videos, it's also in family vlog videos. Those long, a lot of people are doing this. They're, they're like editing, long I don't know what you would call it filler filler and adding music to it and just letting the filler go like some of the truck drivers I've seen usually it's just a lot of road video so they're they'll set their cameras up on their dash and just drive down the road and then there'll be some YouTube music and it'll last for maybe two or three minutes then the camera will go back to them and they'll say something and then it'll go back to the video of the road and for a few minutes playing music and then it'll go back and they'll say something and then that's all you see that's all you see and uh, some people that sit at home they do the same thing when they walk around their house they'll play music uh, YouTube music and maybe show them doing the dishes or something like that and then go back to sitting at the table talking to the camera I and they get a lot of views I mean they'll they'll get five or six thousand views in one day and they'll get like 50 or 60 thousand subscribers people just like watching that I don't know I'm not going to follow that trend, and so my views, if, if, if people like watching that stuff, that's not something I'm going to do. Sometimes I'll show a little bit of video out the road, or, or I might talk a little bit too much, but I like to get out and do things, so like sometimes I'll just park here on the side of the road, walk over, get something to eat, and this is not only for the daily vlog, but for the almost daily vlog, which I'm going to be shooting some video over here for the almost daily vlog. Not of me eating. You guys get to see that on this channel. But uh, look, you got a Titan missile over there, a nuclear warhead sitting right in the parking lot of this restaurant. That's a rocket that you would mount a nuclear warhead on the top, a Titan missile. So I like to get out and, and see these roadside attractions and crazy things. I mean, what good is driving a truck if you don't get to enjoy the places you go? 
So I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to follow that trend of just showing the roadway and adding music to the video and just, I don't know. There's just something about it that I don't get. Uh, I like the people that shoot the videos. I, I, I watch them, but it just gets to me sometimes. And uh, if, if getting subscribers and getting views means doing that, I don't know if I'm going to do it. I don't know. But I do know what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to go shoot a quick, almost daily vlog of that Titan rocket. And then uh, I'm going to go grab something to eat and head on down to Florida. Crystal goodness. Mm-mm-mm. It's bacon. It's bacon. Not that BB-8, but this BB-8 will not shut up. He needs to be like his big brother up here on the dash. got time to kill. I think my appointment is later tonight and I'm back in Florida, back in Florida in Wildwood. So I'm going to surprise my son. I'm going to hop on my bike and uh, head on over. Well, this ain't my bike. That's not my bike. One day, but not right now. That's my bike. That's my bike right here. Zoom, zoom. I'm going to hop on my bike, go see my son, say hi to him and then uh, take you guys down to Orlando to deliver a load, and then Miami. But let's head over and see where my son works. We made it. We made it. Is it gonna focus? There it goes. It was in my pocket. Let's go find out where he is. I've never been here before. They keep trying to offer me a job. Looks like a great place, but I'm kind of happy where I'm at. But who knows what the future holds. But at the moment, let's go find out where he works. What is he doing? What is my son doing? I went to go in the front door. It's locked. It's locked. I was going to go in there and pretend I was doing some sort of inspection. But I don't want to get him in trouble. I went in there. A lot of, a lot of people that uh, used to work with us work here now. I'm like one of the stragglers, scragglers that... Uh, Keep holding on, keep holding on because I'm happy where I'm at. But find out Nick is up here somewhere. There he is, he's right there. <laughs> yeah, I'm on my way to Orlando. So I figured I'd stop by. I haven't been by your yard, even though you worked with me forever. Figured I'd stop by, see what's up, go say hi to Ricky. How you doing? Good, Boy, how you boy, doing? How you doing? Whoa. There he is. He's at work. See, he yeah. does have a job. Yes, I do. <laughs> it's hard to say goodbye. But I'm leaving. I went, I went and see, say bye, Nick. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye, Nick. Bye, Nick. Out oh, there you go. Well, my son's going back to work. Me, I'm going to go back to work and get in my truck, head over to Orlando. So far, what do I think about this place? Not. I met everybody in the office. I know a couple of the dispatchers already from previous jobs. And it's not that bad of a place. They, they uh, welcome you pretty good. If I ever did decide to come over here, I, I can see myself being happy. But it's the quitting a job. Quitting a job that you're secure at, <coughs> going for the unknown. I guess that's a type of exploration, but uh, I don't know if it's an exploration I'm just ready for quite yet. Say goodbye to you for another 14 days or so. Still gotta name you. I'm thinking Torchwood. Torchwood. There's my truck. Our yard's halfway empty. Even in the shop. Hardly anything. And I can walk in our shop.
Hi ho, hi ho. It's off to work I go. It's so hot in here. Hot. Turn the AC on. Definitely high. Margaritaville timeshare is going to be going in right there on a piece of paradise. Come and visit you in about 14 days, but not today. Okay. Look, it's Walt Disney World's hot air balloon. Well, you can't see it now. There it is, downtown Disney, Disney Springs. Was shooting my dash? I have no idea. There's the Marriott. The Marriott. It's a hot one, and not a day of fun. I passed everything that I normally do, like Disney and Universal. Universal's just down this road, not too far away. But I passed Disney, passed SeaWorld, passed all the fun stuff. I just can't do it because today, I have to deliver right down that street. Work days, work days, gotta love them. 
So I'm here, I'm parked, I deliver tonight, I head down to Miami. So since I'm not gonna be doing too much, other than probably ordering a pizza, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off. And uh, thank you guys for watching, viewing, and giving a thumbs up, a like, or whatever it is that you do on YouTube. It's a thumbs up, right? I don't know. Does somebody have a patent on that? Because YouTube uses it. I believe Facebook, or not, or not YouTube, but Facebook, maybe YouTube. And then, now Google Plus uses the circle with the like button. But I wonder if somebody has the patent on that or that, which I don't want to see that. I want to see that. But I'm going to go ahead and sign off. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will talk to you tomorrow from Miami.